Here's what happened at the FIM Snowcross World Championship in Finland. In race number one, it was number three, Adam Renheim, that got off to a good start. But there was a little bit of carnage behind him that kept out some of the favourites as well. But it was this close going into turn two between Renheim and Petter Nasa, both Swedish riders, finishing second and third in the World Championship last year as their numbers on the bike dictate. Christopher Holm, though, wasn't so fortunate as he was left picking his bike up in the early stages of the moto. As the race went on, though, Adam Renheim started to increase his lead over Petter Nasa, but number 40 was having a great ride. He started in fourth, dropped down to fifth before working his way up to third for a few laps before being caught and passed by the number 43, the American Christian Logan on the Arctic Cat. But the flag went out and it was a win for Renheim. Nasa second, Logan was third at the USA. Race two, when the lights turned green, the guys got on the gas, the short start straight into the very tight turn. One, and once again, number seven, Victor Hurton was the early leader, but he came under pressure and was passed on lap three by Christian Logan, the American, and the American then started to do the work up front to try and establish himself ahead of the rest of the field. Behind them, the number three, our winner from race one, Adam Renheim, was down in seventh position. And the number two, Petter Nasa, just a couple of positions ahead. But the three-time former champion, Peter Eriksson, he was out on lap six after a difficult start. He got up to 12th, but would not finish the race. Instead, it was Logan who won from Renheim and Nasa. And those three were battling out for the championship in race three. Coming into the third and final race, Renheim on 47 points, Logan on 45, and Nasser on 42. But Adam Renheim, our winner from race one, was down in 11th position and would lose a couple more positions on lap two, and he started a hard charge through the field, which would eventually see him up inside the top five with a few laps to go. Meanwhile, up front, Petter Nasser was leading away and uh, would lead every single lap of this third and final moto. Behind him was the American Christian Logan, and if it stayed like that, Nasser would be world champion, Renheim would be second, and well, we still had to wait, but third position looked on the cards for Adam Renheim. But as he fought his way through the field, he closed in on the number 43, Christian Logan, the American, and eventually passed him with two laps to go. Petter Nasser would take the checkered flag and win, but with Renheim going into second position on the final two laps, he overtook Christian Logan and Nasser, and he won both the uh, World Championship and the overall round as well. So Nasser would win the race, Renheim second, Logan would be third. But the overall World Championship would belong to Adam Renheim. He would win by two points. 69 from Petter Nasser and Christian Logan. The American, who uh, last time he came to the World Championship two years ago, finished 16th. So a big improvement for him. But that was your overall podium. Adam Renheim, Petter Nasser and Christian Logan. Two Swedes and an American, and the gold plate going to the Swede, delivered of course by Dr. Wolfgang Schrupp, the director of the FIM CMS. And there is your new world champion, 2013 here at Turi in Finland. And with this being the world championship, of course, all three riders picked up their FIM world championship medals. There you go, thank you, thank you. And it really did come down to that final race. Adam, congratulations. You are the 2013 World Snowcross Champion. How do you feel? Yeah, I feel so good. We have uh, so much to do in the beginning of the day to get everything set settled up for the race. But when I could uh, start riding, it, it's a uh, feeling good all day long. And I want to thank my family for everything. They have done some incredible job. The Skido sled, lean shocks, and everyone, the NGM PF racing, so hooking me up so good on the track, and it feels so, so good. Thank you so much, and congratulations.